Number 1. Virginia Aquarium. Lord of exhibits and talks to see. They have finished refurbishing and renovating most of the exhibits. The harbor seals out front start you with a fun time and it keeps up throughout. I'm a fully grown adult kid when wandering through the underwater tunnels. Admission is reasonable for what you get here and everyone left happy. Number 2. Virginia Living Museum. Love this place. It's a unique combination of museum, aquarium, and zoo. It's laid out very nicely with the indoor and outdoor areas intersecting nicely. The animals looked well cared for. I love that it includes all the ecosystems of Virginia and breaks. Number 3. Virginia Zoo. A wonderful morning walking around the Virginia Zoo and it wasn't crowded at all. We had the best time watching the new baby giraffe having the zoom eyes. But if you live nearby it would be worth buying an annual pass in order to visit at different times of day and in different seasons. Number 4. Luray Zoo. If I could rate this place at zero stars I most definitely would, because I was completely underwhelmed and disappointed. It had this urine odor as soon as you walked in the door, and the guy we talked to just seemed really off and weird. The enclosures were absolutely awful and some of the animals just looked so sick. Number 5. Fort Chiswell Animal Park. A bus drives you on a trip narrated by a tour guide around the 45-acre zoo. Expect to pet animals and be spit or drooled on by a Mongolian camel. There are no big cats or elephants, but a visit to this zoo is a nice way to spend a couple hours. Number 6. Creation Kingdom Zoo. The animals here are all awesome. My favorite were the white tigers and the giraffe. Different species of monkeys also my son and two youngest grandchildren loved feeding the monkeys and goats, camels. We will definitely go again but on a cooler day. Overall we all had a blast. Number 7. Three Lakes Nature Center and Aquarium. The Nature Center has been closed for a while now, pandemic-related, of course. Often, after getting there, folks make a beeline for the large deck-slash-platform that adjoins the Nature Center. There is a huge population of turtles. Number 8. Roar Zufari. I have been going to this animal park for 30-plus years and love taking visitors there. We always get a kick out of the baby goats. Most recently, I signed up for the cheetah experience, and it was exceptional. Talk about close-up photos. Number 9. Mill Mountain Zoo. This zoo is small, but children will like it. The collection includes a rare snow leopard. Also be on the lookout for unreal animals around the grounds, that is, artists' renditions of different types of wildlife. Number 10. Sequest Lynchburg. Sequest was awesome. Took my six-year-old and one-year-old granddaughters. The six-year-old loves it especially. She held a python, fed several animals, fed birds three times, fed fish and petted stingrays. The workers were great and helpful. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.